channel. If you are new here, my name is Julia, and today we're going to be doing a good old fashioned what I eat in a day. Absolutely nothing is new with my breakfast. You guys know me by now. I have two egg whites, one egg, and a slice of turkey bacon on a Dave's Killer Bread English muffin every single morning. No matter what time I eat breakfast, it is always this. Like, I am never going to get sick of it. I I fully believe that I will never get sick of this egg sandwich. And then I have a side of raspberries. The only real difference with my breakfast today is I have a cold brew instead of my normal coffee. My amazing friend Alyssa brought me this after F45 today and it's just a cold brew with some oat milk and it is absolutely delicious. But this is breakfast. You guys saw I had my reds and greens. I take those every single morning just in plain cold water. One scoop of each, mix them up, take them. They have worked wonders on my digestion, curbed my cravings, like the list goes on and on. I'm just a big fan. So if you haven't tried reds and greens, this is your sign. I will have them linked down in the description box below. But I'm going to go devour my breakfast and I'll see you guys whenever I eat next. It is currently 1.30. I just got back from training a client, but before I went to my client, you guys saw I did my ankle re-up, I did a workout, I finished with a little bit of bike cardio, and then I had a post-workout shake super quick. Post-workout shake isn't something I have every day. Yes, I do love the post-workout shake that I take, but I also love food. So on the days where I have time to have a full meal after a workout, that is what I will do. But since I had literally like two minutes after I finished my workout before heading out the door to my client, I quickly made up my post-workout shake. It is Formula One and Ignition from First Form. I will have it linked down in the description box below. The chocolate mint cookie flavor is incredible. So I had that quick, so I guess that was like my second meal of the day. Just wanted to get some quick protein in. And then my actual lunch is a bowl of homemade turkey chili. I posted this recipe before, but it's literally just lean ground turkey, crushed tomatoes, diced tomatoes, black beans, hot sauce, and then like a bunch of seasonings and spices. I'm obsessed with it, especially when it is super cold like today. And I wanted to switch things up and not just have my pesto chicken and veggies that I've been having lately. So I actually meal prepped like a ton of this the other day. I just made like a big batch of it and I am really loving my past self for doing that because it just comes in handy for quick lunches and it is also delicious and it's freezing outside. So turkey chili is my lunch today. I will see you guys whenever I eat next. Also, thought I would mention, I am a half gallon in to my gallon of water. So, so far I have consumed 64 ounces. Alright, clearly I have showered. It is almost 6 p.m. and I am done with all of my client work for the day. So I'm gonna start prepping dinner for Cameron and I. We're gonna do salmon, asparagus, and sweet potatoes tonight. Salmon, just like always, we're gonna do it pan seared in our cast iron skillet. We do it for about five minutes on top of the stove and then we pop it in the 400 degree oven for four to five minutes. 
I do mine with smoked paprika and Cameron is on like a honey garlic kick. So that's what we're going to do with his. And then for the asparagus, we just put on a pan, drizzle some olive oil and then salt, pepper and garlic powder. And then on a typical day, I would like buy sweet potatoes, dice them up, pop them in the air fryer or oven. But on my lazy days, AKA today, I buy these frozen sweet potatoes the brand picked sweet farms vegetables for roasting the only ingredient in this is sweet potatoes so i just pop these right in the air fryer we eat the entire bag there are four servings but camera and i eat a lot so sweet potatoes asparagus and salmon that's what we're having for dinner let's get prepping Alright guys, that is going to be it for today's full day of eating. As you saw, I did snack on some raspberries while I was cooking and then I don't think I showed you guys, but Cameron and I had some frozen dark chocolate covered espresso beans from Trader Joe's. They don't come frozen, we froze them. We snacked on some of those while we were doing some computer work. He is still working right now. Don't really know if I'll have dessert. I do have to finish up my gallon of water. I probably have like 12 ounces left. If I do have dessert, it'll either be a banana or some popcorn. But I am going to wrap this video up here. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a like, give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all next time. Bye.